So what's going on guys? So we are at another homestead. And you see these little, two little, my little buddies right here. Now, here's their, these are their parents behind me, and they are irrelevant. <laughs> this is all about these guys. So we have Logan and Tyler. Why don't you introduce yourselves? I'm Logan, the big brother. I'm Tyler, the little brother. And what do y'all do? Well, we plants and tomatoes and squash and zucchini, like that stuff. So these two guys right here, they have a YouTube channel called, called Those Lane Boys, right? Right. And they grow, they start sprouts, and they're actually in a store, right? Mm -hmm. Now, what's, do you know the name of that store? No. No? Uh, let's, let's ask Mommy. What's the name of the store, Mommy? Daniel's Feed and Seed. Now, how cool is that? These two little guys learned about YouTube Wait. and plants. You learned plants at school, too? Well, not really. We don't learn plants at school. So where did you learn about plants? Well, my, she learned about from a book. Yeah? Yeah, so you... and she, she taught it to us, and, and someday we're going to teach it to our kids. Oh, wow, that will be great. So you want to show me some of your plants that you're, you're growing? Yes, sir. All right, well, let's go check out the little, the little shop. So tell me about what you have in here right now. Tomatoes and we, we put these little sticks here so they could stand up. I like we it. Had some street so do you know what kind of tomatoes you have growing in right now? Uh, I think different colored ones yeah, than I see, red. I see you have them labeled. Let's see, we got some San Marzano. I've got some of those plant, planted at my house right now. And these are green. So like your fried green tomatoes? Yep. Ooh, those will be yummy. Have you ever had fried green tomatoes? Nah. Oh, you need to try it. We don't like tomatoes. You don't like tomatoes? Yeah. He likes tomatoes and corned beef and hash. Ooh, corned beef and hash. Mm, yum. So we got some, what's that, it says garden monster? No! But it's a, but it's a, but it's a friendly garden monster. Oh, that's a, a friendly is always good. Garden cherry rainbows. So we're gonna talk to you, Mom, for just a second. So how did we get in, in a store, Mommy? Uh, that's the feed store that we use for our animals. Okay. And the woman that works there, the owner, she's fantastic mm -hmm. and she loves the boys and they were just little chatty Cathy's and she offered to have them in the store. How amazing. These two little boys right here. If you if you think you can't garden or that you can't grow plants, let this be a testimony to you that, that you can. Because look at them. I mean, learning, they wanna they wanna share it with their own kids and now even little entrepreneurs starting the YouTube, sharing with people, and then now they're in a store. They're in a store. I mean, that's, that's, I'm an adult, and I'm not even in a store. I want to be in a store. And they truly do it all themselves. I mean, we have yeah. the videos to prove it. So definitely, I miss doing it. I don't get to do it anymore. Well, hey, you, you gotta, you gotta grow more. I do. You gotta grow more. We gotta get a bigger, bigger greenhouse. So now it's time you to start. That. You so hear that? You hear that? You hear that, Dad? It's time to time to get bigger. So they're out here in Aiken, yes. right? This is Aiken, and they're on what you said, ten acres, ten oh. acres. Now, they don't just grow plants. They've got some cool animals over here behind me. So let's uh, let's go on an adventure. Who are you playing with right now, Logan? Penny. Penny. This one. Yes. It's a bull. Bull. It's a bull. What kind of bull? It's a type of zebu, and this is Stella. Stella's pet pregnant. Stella, that's my grandmother's name. This is probably the most friendly donkey I've ever met in my life. She's not loud. Look at the boys. The boys are just hanging all over. So guys, I hear you have a grow room inside where you start all of your plants. Yeah, there's like two billion. <laughs> two billion. Yeah. Like two billion. You want to show me? I'd love to see it. And I think we still have some tomatoes in there, maybe, maybe not. And I think they're ginormous, like this big. Wow. Well, you want to show me? Yes. All right, let's go. What do y'all have in here? I see you've got some. You've got some potatoes, huh? Come on, potatoes and purple potatoes. Ooh, purple potatoes. I've never had a purple potato. Well, you could take one home. <laughs> well, thank you. So what else do you have growing? What's is this dill? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So dill, I mean, you want to know something cool about dill? What? If you plant dill with your tomatoes, and let them flower, make flowers, 
the um, ladybugs like to use their nectar and it, it's, it helps them. Because ladybugs have little bitty mouths, so on your bigger flowers, they can't drink the nectar out of them. So those, those dill flowers really are good for, for ladybugs. Now what are these big plants right here? I think they're tomatoes. Crook neck squash. So that's why it looks like it has a crooked neck. Yeah. <laughs> very good, very good. Now what are some of these on the bottom, do you know? Mm. I see some cilantro. Cilantro is really good too. And I don't know any but cilantros. Tip. And we have oregano, some more dill. These are all of our flowers for our pollinators. Yeah. And zucchini. What is that? What is this? Cucumbers. What else is good to plant for ladybugs? What did we do a video on? What flower is good for ladybugs? Uh, I can't remember. <gasps> Some flowers are also good for ladybugs. Oh yeah. Because even though they're big, yeah, they still they're have actually like a bunch pollen. of little bitty flowers. Yeah, and and once the the bee like bees like it too, so once the bee delivers the pollen Yo, the, to another sunflower, it gets some nectar, so it can make more seeds. That's right. So need to make sure you tell your dad, don't cut the grass this early. Yeah. You know he, why? Because of the benefits of the dandelions. Yeah. Did you know that you can actually eat dandelions? You yourself? Yeah, and there's what little is, seeds in there you can eat too. Yep, you what did eat. we make with our dandelions? Last last year we made dandelion cookies. That's right. Mm. Cookies? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, made, I made dandelion um, honey with mine. Really? I boiled them down, yep. All right, guys. Well, I appreciate y'all letting me hang out with y'all today and uh, show me around your cool little thing. I hope y'all definitely check these little boys out and, and give them some love. Help them grow their their business and, and stuff on YouTube. So, I appreciate you hanging out with me today. We'll see you on the next video. Uh, we'll see you on the next video.